Hey guys, it's Carly Christman and I'm wearing drop crotch pants because I want you to know we're at my house and I keep it casual. <laughs> hey guys, it's Carly Christman and today I'm going to be taking you inside my closet at my house and showing you some of my favorite pieces. I don't know if you guys can tell this, I kinda love neutrals. I'm obsessed with anything color coding, organization. I start with all the whites first and then I make my way down into the grays and the blacks. So this first dress in my closet is actually a dress that I wore to Elton John's Oscar party last year. I went with Banana Republic as a guest of theirs and they provided this dress for me and it was just such a fun night. I keep pillows in my purses and the reason I have this like massive pillow in here is no, not because I'm going to a lot of sleepovers, but because I like to keep the shape of my purses and this kind of keeps them looking nice. Or if you're displaying a bag on a shelf in your closet, this would be a really great way to let your purse stand up instead of it just being like, meh. I feel like there's a theme, like the first in each of this section is something really important to me because this first outfit right here is this white two-piece set. It's the skirt and this white top. And I have given a series of talks at Google's across the country about how brands can better work with social media influencers. And I wore this outfit to speak on a panel at Google in Chicago. And Chicago is my hometown, so it just really was a special moment for me. For those days when you just can't even, am I right, ladies? Am I right? I have 6,000 striped shirts, as you can see, and that's because I'm basically Where's Waldo of fashion. This dress is kind of like a shifty tunic dress and it's Diane von Furstenberg. And I bought this dress when I hit 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. It was kind of my gift to myself to commemorate the big moment that it was. Realistically, when I get up in the morning, I like roll out of bed and I'm like, black clothes on me. Looks good, let's go. I'm from Chicago and I love hockey and sports. So the last time I was in town, my brother and I got matching jerseys together and went to a game I just got this, this is my new obsession, my new baby for the moment. I always used to joke that if I had a child, I would get them the baby Balenciaga, and then I just bought it for myself because I'm clearly not having a baby anytime soon. <laughs> but I wanted the baby first. So this dress has a lot of memories for me. When I was at Coachella this past year, I was at the fashion shows that were going on and Tracy Reese had this dress on her runway and I went up to her after the show and I was like, Loved your collection, especially outfit number six. And she was like, do you want to wear it tonight? And I was like, do I want to wear your outfit off the runway tonight? Yes, yes I would. So she actually went and took this dress and the shoes off the model and gave them to me after the show. So I went to Coachella that night wearing this straight off the runway dress. And that was such an exciting moment for me. This was the first piece I designed for my clothing line. For those days you want to wear full on sequin pajamas. And having this like in my hands and knowing that this is something I wanted to make is the coolest feeling in the world. It's so cool to wake up and be like, oh, the thing I always wanted to wear, I have it. It's in my closet. I can wear it right now. Valentino is probably my favorite shoes for heels. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but I have like very thick, fluffy socks stuffed inside of this ankle boot because it helps keep the shape, especially when you're displaying shoes. I have a pair of Louboutin heels, which I bought myself to wear to runway castings back when I used to do runway modeling. Cause I was like, ooh, I need a pair of nice black heels. That's an excuse to buy Louboutins. And they're the most uncomfortable shoes in the world. If you can wear these shoes, like you are a better woman than I because I can't keep these on for more than an hour. All right guys, that's it for my closet tour. I hope you enjoyed hanging out at home with me and seeing some of my favorite pieces. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>